What time do you call it? How's the glue doing? Stop that engineer. Today's Qantas flight to Singapore is going nowhere. It's stuck on the ground. One of the engines has been damaged and it's being repaired using glue. Duty manager John Cull needs a cockpit conference to discuss tactics. The earliest you can push is half past 11, so that gives you a 15 minutes delay. I see. Do you want to board the passengers now, or should we hang on to them for a while? Um, we've got a full load, haven't we? You have, yeah. yeah. We can board them slowly, if I'm you like. I'm going to hand that question over to Jim, because Jim's, Jim's uh, the... going to be flying a sector, so it's his Hi, Jim. Right, over, over to you, Jim. Well, I can't see why not. Okay. Such yeah. a... The sooner we can get away, the better. OK, so, yeah. all right. Engineers are worth keeping an eye on anyway. <laughs> <laughs> Especially if they're using glue. With the glue drying slowly, John's passengers can now begin boarding slowly. Welcome to on board for the flight down to Singapore this morning. It usually sets in about 30 to 45 minutes, this stuff. But today, the glue just will not set. So is that everyone? Qantas, John speaking. Just to let you know that we are complete passenger-wise, everybody's through the gate. Well, they're not actually Mark, because we've just got a lady coming through now. She must be the last one, then. OK, yeah, no worries. She's running down now. I'm following her, not running down now. So if you can just hang on for a few seconds before you close the doors. And it's still slightly decky at the moment. And you'll take about another five... 5 to 10, 15 minutes. The problem is the uh, cold ambient temperature and the sealant requires slightly warmer. As the engineers wait for the glue to dry, the passengers are still stuck on the ground. Desperate times call for desperate measures. The giant hot air dryer has been summoned. I think it's going to be another half an hour now to be on the safe side. Brian, half an hour. Well, we've got a quick setting with this thing blowing on it, I should think. Yeah, what we have here is a food two part mix. And uh, it's the chemical reaction between the two compounds that causes the heat to. Uh, the sealant to kill. Uh, what we're doing is uh, applying some heat which we managed to get hold of. Uh, as soon as the sealant is cured, uh, we'll uh, release the aircraft for uh, flight. All right, I'll leave you to it then. The glue's still setting and the Qantas flight is already late. Passengers are in danger of missing connecting flights and everyone's still unaware of just what's going on beneath their feet. Good. That's what we like to see. <coughs> Rob, uh, we reckon about 10 more minutes. OK, they've got a uh, blow dryer now on this, so uh, they reckon it's going to be another 10 minutes or so. All right, then, I'll speak to you soon. The glue has set at last. It's all right. That's great. Come on, get rid of it. What time do you call it? Okay, is this the last one? Push back clearance, and we are going. Hot stop, morning. Uh, Steve, the aircraft push back. I make it two seven, but I'll confirm when I get back. Anyway, he's on his way. Thank you. Thank you. All right. Cheers, Steve. Thank you. Yeah. 